Hey guys, Brian and Carter here. And we actually have a flash back there today too. It looks like he's coming for a ride. Carter, look back there at that cat. I want to go with Look back there at Flash. <laughs> flash, now is your chance to get off, buddy. <laughs> Are you you're gonna go with us? You can. I can He's still on. I cannot believe. Oh, nope, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Uh, we are going to go do a little bit of an early feed time because it looks like it is about to pour down rain on us. And we don't want to get caught in that, but we want to make sure the babies are adequately taken care of as usual. Oh no, Jake's hollering at me. I was supposed to go get the diesel can from the back before it rains, and I was supposed to do that way earlier. I used all the diesel on the tractor for my chicken coop and I'm still not done over there. So I will be the good sister and go get the can of diesel like I was already supposed to. I forgot to ask where it is. Oh, I should have listened. I ran away instead. I did go the entirely wrong way. And then I had to go through an extra game. Do y'all know how upsetting that is? Why are all three of you goats hanging out in that hole? What are y'all doing down in there? Hi, Mr. Pickles. I'm supposed to be getting the diesel, but I've always got a minute to love you. Oh, I sure love you. Uh, it looks like Glenn and Littlefoot are friends. Glenn's not really ready to see me yet. Littlefoot obviously don't care. You're not coming out, so don't don't try this with me. Don't you don't you do it. No, I know how you like to do me, and we're not gonna do this. We're not. I'm gonna come in, I'm gonna latch this gate, and then I'm just gonna get the diesel can. Okay? Go on about your business. No, see? No, you better mind your own. He was ready to do it. Uh-huh, he's gonna gripe at me now. We're in the clear. See, this is gonna be a problem. I don't want to be mistaken for food. Oh God. I had to make a run for it with the diesel can. I had to make a run for it because they thought it was food, but I'm good. I'm in the clear. I made it. Just a little tired. Hey, Carter. Hey, Carter. Why did you stack all this stuff in this barn like a crazy person? I did, did I do it? No. I don't think I did it either, but Mama really does like this stuff I'm finding in here. Hi, guys. I'm Brienne. And one bad thing about me. I keep anything that looks like it could be a nice chicken brooder. What, baby? Sure, what's a good idea? Go into the goats? Of course. So guys, I've got my cart, my little green cart. Race! I'm gonna catch you. I've got a whole cart full of regular hay. Um, that way, anything that doesn't fit in the hay bag can go back into the barn in the wagon. Um, once I got all my other ducks in a row with all the projects I need to get started and finish on, <laughs> I plan to help Jake get the last of that big stuff he doesn't want and just finish getting that barn area all cleaned up. This is just regular hay for the goats to go in the hay bag. Uh, not green hay, not alfalfa. Just their regular, everyday roughage, I guess you could call it. Um, we're gonna go get this stacked up for them and then come back with some grain. What are y'all gonna do to it? I know y'all are gonna try to mess something up, so let's see. Let's see it. Don't jump on it, Elfie. You can eat it if you want, don't jump on it. Oh, Lefty! Lefty! <laughs> 
Oh, now they're breaking it, of course. Sometimes it can be really hard to be productive with, with goats. Sorry, I dropped this. Let me just grab, let me, this lefty, just let me grab it. So out of the entire cart of hay that I brought over here in a full bag, <laughs> This is how much is still in the wagon. That's why it has to be refilled so often because it doesn't hold too much. And I had a second one over here too and they tore it down. I never put it back up, but I might look into some bigger hay bags like the ones that my dad has or even just another second one. Excuse me. Yeah, they've knocked this down too. So when I bring their grain, I guess I'm gonna come back with the screw gun. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Come back with the screw gun and try to screw it into this one so it doesn't fall. I am nowhere near as good at climbing into these things as the goats apparently are. But now we can, now we can fix it. Patched playground, goats that just ate that still act like they're starving to death. And now onto the chickens. Carter's already got her a tower going over there with some of my scrap materials. No guys, my floor in here still is not done. I am still waiting on my lime to get here. Um, nobody is using the lay boxes yet because I still need to add my shavings, but they are laying eggs out here. So this is good. We're also taking this away because look, that is ridiculous. And this thing is Almost empty, and it's all here, all over the floor, taking the whole bucket of feed. We'll replace it when they clean up the ground. But right now, I think Carter is going to help me go on a little uh, Easter egg hunt because we only got another five eggs in the coop today, and that is not enough for me. So we're going to go look in the known places. Carter, come on! Are there feed buckets? This is not what I come over here for. But I appreciate you helping me. I came over here to look for eggs and look for eggs only. And now I've Well, while you're looking for eggs in there, fill up them hay bags. <laughs> I look for eggs every day. I haven't been getting as many in my coop the past two days. I've only gotten four or five eggs. I do this right now. I'm gonna go ahead and put their feed in these buckets and we'll just dump them in there. That's fine. I need to fill that one up too. They all need to be refilled. You need to check them and they all need to be refilled probably. It looks like that needs a couple of handfuls. Where did Carter girl go? Oh. He's not And maybe pull a little bit out of that hole so they can get a hold of it good. We need to go get some feet. Yeah, I know. There you go. That's what I do to mine. Free. I pretend that my hand is a horse's mouth and pull it out like they would bite it. Yeah, that's what I do too. It's funny. Thank you, sweetheart. You're welcome. Oh, and thank you too, sweetheart. <laughs> okay, your hair looks so cute. Thank you for picking them sticks up. I can't help you. You're so tired. Oh, I'm so sorry. You know what's funny? Hmm. I've got a video probably on my Instagram or TikTok of Brimley Grace about her age out there in the barn working with me with some stuff. And she said, I am so tired. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Here she comes. Put your hand out. Let her come get it from you. There you go. She's coming. She really understands the whole treat thing now. She does. Stand very still there, Car. She'll come get it. Don't drop it, Carter. Don't drop it. You make it get it out of your hand. Help push it into her teeth. Carter, don't drop it. <laughs> Hold your arm up. Put your arm back up. There you go. Oh. Turn it up <laughs> so she can get it. Move, Feather. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Hold it out, Bar. There you go. Good, Good job, job. Carter. 
You quit picking out of my hand, Joe. You're staring there. You can't jump around. What are you doing in there? Uh -oh. Hey. She just took you. <laughs> Lulu was wanting to do one too. Kiss Carter. I'll kiss you. Kiss, stay here, Buffy. Oh, bog, I mean, uh, uh, tree goat is mad that she's not in here getting snacks. Punky. It bit me. Did she get, aww. just can't finish the transfer. Yeah. It makes me nervous. Shove it in her teeth. Good, Good job. job. Come on. I'm sure I've got hay all over me. Good girl, Buffy. Yeah. It's okay. Whoa. Whoa. It is. Whoa. Whoa. You hear Buffy eating those things? That's how you sound eating those <laughs> You didn't want to. <laughs> Billy didn't want you to either, buddy.